Dear Jersey City. My prayer, for you all there in Jersey City. I never had heard of anything like this before in Jersey City, New Jersey before from, where I have lived now 47 years. However, with the last days of the coming of Jesus Christ, these are the signs in which brings about sins that are taking over our society, and how evil has taken control of our government over and over. However, most of us looks for an answer and a sign from somewhere to make a reality statement of it all but we must recognize the illnesses in society not leaving us no time to think on how we can resolve these evil problems. In addition, many of us would like to see a human transformation, one that changes the morals, characteristics, ethnics, however, the fact is a growing antichrist are arising in our nations bring among us threats of deadly life situation like the one we see here among the Jersey City police officers here in Jersey City, New Jersey. In fact, the truth is that our society is growing into a fast state of technology but we are not growing fast enough to recover from society illnesses nor are we growing fast enough to heal a sick nation. Now, yesterday this tragedy did not had to happen but it did and my question is passing gun laws really helping to share our society? As lawmakers. We heard over and over in our nations about passing gun laws but this seems not to work, because several Jersey City police officers are wounded and the other suspects are dead. Listen to me, have we solved the problem, because some died in this shootout in Jersey City, New Jersey? The answer is no. We have not resolved the problem because we have not deal with the issue which is the human nature therefore we are losing the gun war in our society but another thing is what we might have created is more violence against police officers and our lives to life safe in society. However, the issue here is human transformation. A transformation that would govern our society to learn to respect human lives which in the case of the shootout in Jersey City, New Jersey there were no respect of human lives, and if you notice the respect of human lives are growing less and less from human nature. In addition, the tradition of the old-fashioned religion seems to disappear from us every day of our lives leaving us dismayed. Moreful and hurt by the everyday pain that we face, as we take another look into society that leading a evil nations. One that is desperately in need of healing, transformation, guidances, and care among the people of the United States of America. However, we are prisoners in our home afraid to go outside because of the everyday evil we hear in our society. Besides the evil in our world had lead parents to feel a frightened feeling of death each and every day they sent their children off to school. This is not the way we should live in United States of America being afraid every time we go out not afraid of death but afraid of being separated from those we love nor not afraid of dying be afraid who we left behind to defend themselves which are our little ones. So as a nation, we must rise up and stand against the focus of evil not only behind the wall of wars in which display taking down the evil ones but we must display a higher hierarchy, a nation of peace, love and a land of opportunity in which we are long losing the battle, for but is described in our hungry, homeless and drug abused nation. Be bless http colon slash slash legal systems network dot com